Hey guys, welcome back to episode three of Build Off. Um, I did the honors last time, Richard. You go ahead and do them. Same rules as last time. It's gonna Indeed. be pretty great. Aha, purple. Okay. Purple is wait, dark cozy. purple. Wait, no, is it purple? It's this one, fortress. Fortress. Okay, so fortress is the decision and the theme. All right. Good luck. So I guess. Indeed. Oh wait, uh, spawn animals is on because I just had it on Omni slabs. One second. Alrighty. All right. All right. Here we are. Here we are. Fortress theme. Fortress theme. Count down. Ah, okay, well, whatever, whatever. Fine, 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 fine. Okay, so let's see. How are we going to do this? So fortress, fortress will probably require a good number of resources along the lines of such as these. Uh, maybe even some cobblestone walls. I might be able to incorporate them. Let's see. Definitely some other slab types. Mmm... Maybe incorporate some lapis, perhaps, chiseled stone brick, maybe even some nether brick action. Let's see where this takes me. Okay, so let's see, how big do I want to, I guess I probably want to make sort of a section of a fortress and just have, uh, big did I make that? Three, so I want to make it three indeed. And just have sort of a section of, if not the entrance, then like the side. Uh, like a, just a portion of a uh, wall that is fortress-like in construction and atmosphere. So... bring this in. Trying to give the wall a bit of depth here. How big did I make that gap? Three. How about another gap roughly like that? And then I'll do that. And then... How did I do this? How did I do this? This one requires symmetry. Uh, so yeah, like that. Then bring it up, and bring it up, and like that. And that gives something of a sense of depth there. Throw in some cobblestone walls to help reinforce to some degree. And now I'll add in the inner walls, which I think I'll have some slabs involved. Oh, nope. Wait, how did I do this? What am I doing? Ah, okay. Something like this, maybe? We'll see how that looks. Then, it's like right across like that. And, a bit like that. This will set me up for a nice wall walk as well. Maybe I can add windows here. See how that ends up looking. Yeah, that might work. Conceivably. Uh, then this can continue up here as sort of a wall walk sort of thing. Perhaps. So you can get up here and look out over the scenery. Not bad. Not bad at all. Some accentuations on the top here. For good measure. Just a bit like that. 
probably going to want to bring this the rest of the way across as sort of a roof sort of thing. So I can have an interior sort of area. I'm not sure. How am I going to do this interior? I'm thinking actually I'll raise this back up again so as to give more room on the interior side of things and provide a little bit more dynamics where shape is concerned. How am I going to do this? What is this going to look like? It's going to look like that. And yeah, that's not bad. I can actually, I might even be able to make this be some kind of like sort of a pillar sort of thing, sort of deal. Hmm. Yeah, it's not too bad. Definitely am going to need some lighting in through here. So, be like right in the windows to light it up rather nicely. Not totally sold on the cobblestone fences, but they're not bad. And this outer wall is definitely looking noticeably plain. Uh, this layer here is wide open. I can change that without affecting anything on the interior. So maybe something like this. Is this going to work at all? Not sure. Let's see if it works. Uh, it's not great, but it's not bad either. I'm thinking I might experiment with fooling, twiddling this up a little bit. Looks better from... Mm, hmm. Maybe this should be some kind of table space working area of some kind. Yeah, you know what? That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make this some form of... Actually, maybe this is a blacksmith sort of shop area um, in one wing of the castle. I can add uh, maybe stables over here, something like that. But yeah, add in some flooring. Then, uh, where am I going to go with this? This through here is going to be sort of a, an open uh, courtyard area. So this is all going to be... sort of working around that sort of thing. I like the idea of including sort of a blacksmith shop, blacksmith sort of area. He needs more of a space to stand, though. And he's going to need a bunch of furnaces. Let me go ahead and grab furnaces, where the that would be in decoration for some reason. Uh, and I can also grab maybe like some crafting tables. Oh, I want an anvil. Anvil will be very good indeed. Uh, furnaces. And then the crafting table, maybe just for looks. And yeah, that, that's not too bad. And like the anvil right there. That's not too bad, it's not too bad. I can see that working. Throw in some ch chest action. Uh, be there, yeah, that's not too bad. This can be sort of his work area. And can he have on his desk there? Give him... Uh, well, I can throw some item frames around to allow for some 
item action. What sort of thing? Uh, no, perhaps. Hmm, what does that look like? There's no real reason. <laughs> I don't know. That's not bad. Be nice if I could set it up somehow in these. Actually, that's that's not too bad. Yeah. Yeah, that actually kind of works. I like it. Uh then yeah, I'll throw that there. I'll figure out something to put in there. Maybe Hmm. Hmm. Sure, why not? I'll just dump an anvil in there. Ten minutes in. Okay. Running out of time to mess about here. I guess I will just replace this stuff with... Yeah, whatever. More stone bricks. Along the bottom here. And... Then... Give me the slabs again. I'll just fill up the rest of this area for now because I'm not sure what else to do with it and may as well replace this so that it looks a little nicer on the edge here because that's the sort of thing that for some reason I am worrying about alright and then maybe I make this into a courtyard with some grass. The grass area will be more or less a bit like that. Yeah, it's not too bad. That's actually quite nice. I like it. Uh, and then maybe saddle there and set up some stuff like this and fence gates just for horse purposes let me throw a horse in there for good measure uh... oop nope nope what are they doing where are they being sp oh spawn animals is off alright whatever no horses then doesn't matter much to me. I'll find ways to make it work. Okay, and... Yeah, I can just sort of throw another item frame on here as well. Throw in some diamond horse armor. Yeah. Cool. And... Let's see. It's not much going on on the outside still. I'm just gonna go for a real easy solution, I think. Try and add a little bit of character to the outside. Just throw, whack down some bone meal around. To at least have something. And... Yeah, it's really not nearly as much as I would have liked to do, but the interior looks pretty okay. Exterior is decidedly lacking what if I throw that like that that's not too bad that kinda wants to be like that I could maybe oh what if I do like that kinda thing nice coal very nice professional gamer. Actually, then I can do this kind of thing. See if that looks good. No, not every one. Not every single one, just every other one. Yeah, maybe. Yeah, that's not bad. That, that's that got a better shape to it. Uh, then... 
Yeah, up here looks pretty nice. It's not too great, but it's decent. Let me grab another torch for up here. Not loving the torch spam sorta lighting patterns I got going, but it's, you know, it's what it is. Uh, I'm not sure I'm going to be able to do a whole heck of a lot more in the time allotted, because I am going to be out of time very shortly. Oh man, no, don't do that. Uh, no. Outside, you know what? Outside we'll get fence posts with torches on it, because I don't really have time to do much else. One, two, oh no, oh no, oh no, okay, I'm done, <laughs> alright, let's get in the Skype call. Two, we're back, um, how do you like my added touch with the, uh, teleportation? I, that took me quite by surprise. <laughs> uh, <laughs> It actually sort of eliminates some of the amazement of the walls falling, but... Oh, wow. Oh, crap. That's that's right. That's very cool. Oh, thank you. I like what you did with this. Ma'am, I tried spawning horses to have, like... <laughs> so did I. So did I. But, yeah. Oh, man. Ah, oh, dude. You always build your build, like, over here. I know. <laughs> I know. I get started and do something very specific, and then I don't do anything with the rest of the space. I was actively trying to place torches around, and, like, I misplaced one, and I was trying to get rid of it, and then I got teleported. So, <laughs> <laughs> so that was you could, uh You could just practice on your own time, honestly. Uh, but, I, I don't know. I don't know. I kind of want to get better as things go. Alright, cool. That was awesome. Another, was, I loved that one. This is really cool, and I, I definitely need to... I knew that I wasn't, you know... Yeah. I, I I knew that the terrain on mine is just garbage, but <laughs> I sort of I'd... went for other things. I don't know if that's I don't know if it worked or not. Uh, I, I didn't talk a whole lot in my commentary. I'm not sure why. I should have done it. Yeah, I was kind of bad as well. Yeah. Okay, that was a lot of fun though. I enjoyed that one. Yeah, that was um, pretty good. Let me give you a little tour of my area here. Okay, sure. Um, here we've got the moat, we got a dispenser here, mm. um, got cobblestone wall as an extra line of defense. If you come in here, this ladder will sure. take you down inside of here, and oh, there's wow. the yep. control for uh -huh. yep. for the dispenser, gotcha. indeed. And that's about it. I think that um, this waterfall here has a whole lot of depth to the build. Um, yeah, I like that. That's pretty neat. Thank you. Thank you. That's, that's good. It's very good. Yeah. I should have added at least, like, a tree or two. Like, <laughs> <laughs> at, at the very least, I could have done something like that. No, dude, you did a really good job this on this, is, though. No, this area is sort of, like, this is like the corner, the very corner of some larger fortress sort of thing. Yeah, I could tell. And, like, hey, you've got the nice impressive wall walk. Um, and just inside here, like, this corner would be, like, the blacksmith's corner. Yeah. And oh, yeah, like, you did spend a lot of time on that. And I then tell. right in here, like, this would be leading onto the stables. And, again, I tried to spawn <laughs> a horse several times, didn't get anything. Got kind of confused, yeah. then I realized the spawn animals was off. Uh, <laughs> and yeah. then in, in here would be just a larger courtyard sort of area. But Indeed, indeed. No, it's... You did a good job on this one, though. I like yours. Hmm. Came out okay. I could have I could have definitely added a tower. A tower would not have been out of place in this corner of things. Uh, it is such a time crunch. It's, yeah, it really is. Yeah, for mine, I did a lot of a similar thing to um, what I did for Ruins, where I just made it look like really worn and torn. Hmm. Um, but not quite as worn and torn. Yeah, yeah. It works. Like, it not works not bit. weathered, but, like, it's seen some stuff. Sure. Mm -hmm. Very okay. nice. So, who won? Uh, and also, next theme. 
in the comments. Thank you indeed for watching. So, talk to you guys later. Peace out.